that happened fast. Can you please watch where you're going? Well, actually, technically, you ran into me. <sighs> Great. I was on my last mile, and I have no idea how fast it was. Well, you were moving. Not easy to knock me down. I have a pretty much <clears throat> center of gravity. Pretty solid. I'm just going to call it a 450. You ran a 450? Not bad. <sighs> you know, I once ran a 516. That's slower. Well, not everything's a competition. If it were, I'd win. Are you flirting with me? Not at all. Are you flirting with me? Well, that depends. Is it working? No. You know, I feel good about us as partners. 23 says that's important. Trust is must. That's what 23 says. Does he? Anyway, I think you and I share a bond. We both know what it feels like to look into the mirror and not like what we see. I mean, you have a surgery, I lost a lot of weight. Look at this. Can you believe this was me? Yes, well, change is good. Listen, if we're posing as a married couple, we probably may, should make sure that we have our story straight. Um, okay. We met at Michigan State, married after graduation. Uh, you love my parents. I hate yours. Uh, no kids. Do we want kids? Sure, you do, but I'm concentrating on my career. Well, that doesn't seem fair. I mean, I'm older than you, and <laughs> you're not getting any younger. Tick, tick. Hey. Meryl Streep had a kid when she was 42, so shut up. Here's the goddamn drink card. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what? You don't see that guy? I feel like you might as well be holding up a sign that says hi and just ask him to kill you. So, uh, that must have been some kiss. How did you know it would work? Have you kissed other men that were plummeting to their death? Okay, listen. So far, our partnership has consisted entirely of me getting you out of trouble. Want to know why? Because you keep leading. Here's how we're changing that. I lead now. I'm the one with field experience. You know nothing. I beg to differ. I looked up your field agent exam, and I outscored you by eight points. That's the difference between an A- and an A+, by the way. We're not in a classroom, Max. This is real. And we're really going to die unless you start listening to me. And anybody can misspell Kyrgyzstan. Someone's got a chip on her pretty little shoulder. All right. You're faced with an assassin. What do you do? I shoot him. You don't have a gun. Well, the field manual says that nature separate. Excuse me, I'm talking. Bang. Uh, why are you shooting more? Bang. I said I was. Bang. Please Bang. stop Bang. doing that. Throw out your manual. Out here, there are no graves. There's only dead or not dead. Well, you know I'm not helpless without a gun. I have been trained extensively in martial arts. Hmm. Ow! I wasn't ready. Hesitated. Well, it's obvious he realized he was up against a man who possessed skills for which he had no answer. Or perhaps because you're standing in front of a case of explosives. Right. You know, it's really a shame. Well, I agree, 99, but he did start it. No, I mean, it's a shame for us. I don't follow. Excuse me. Hi. Hello. What did you really send to the bakery in Venice? Hmm? And why did my partner think your friend was radioactive? And where's Chaos hiding the news? Come on, speak up. You're the whole reason why we came to Venice. The fate of the world hangs in the balance. You could make your point without all of 